adults, Kate from the Literary Apothecary, and today we're going to talk about Patience of a Dead Man by Michael Clark. Now, I read this as part of the Olympics readathon. This was my Hades prompt, and this was also my a birthday read for me from my friend Sharon Dwyer. It's one of her absolute favorite books, a whole series, really. It's the first book in a series, and so I knew I had to read it. And wow, what a book this was. I gave this four out of five stars because I thought it was... I'm not used to horror books or suspense books like this, so there was some things that seemed a little predictable to me. There was some things that I didn't necessarily agree with, but overall, I really enjoyed reading this book. It kept me scared the whole time. There was jump scares in it. There was one bit where I was reading during daylight with all the lights on in a normal setting, and the front door opened just like it normally does, and I jumped. And it, it, it was that kind of a book. And it was a, such a um, crazy ride. Um, the ending was totally unexpected. I, I'm going to skip to spoilers here. The ending was unexpected. I didn't know whether our main character was going to survive or not. I didn't know whether our second main character, the real estate agent, was on the good side or the bad side. I think the one biggest gripe that I had with this is that it didn't necessarily feel like it needed to be a romance for me. We have this relationship developing between our two main characters, um, Tim, who's just moved to town after a really nasty divorce, and the real estate agent who I can't, I think her name is Holly. Um, and there's like a, this relationship that develop is, develops between them. And it didn't, to me, it didn't feel like this relationship was needed. It could have just been a friendship or even just a realtor realty type of relationship but we have this romance develop between them and it I mean it worked for the story but it didn't feel like it was needed so that's my main gripe in this um, I like I said I really enjoyed it it kept me guessing throughout the whole thing I had no idea what was gonna happen and I'm so glad I read this and I can't wait to read the rest of the series my favorite quote was sadness was an understatement and that just rang true to me i've been in those situations where the word sadness and the description of sadness just doesn't do what you're feeling justice and so patience of a dead man like i said i gave four out of five stars i enjoyed it tremendously i can't wait to continue with this series i'm so glad i read this and went way out of my comfort zone um and yeah go and read it. It's a quick read. It's a fantastic horror read. If you're looking for books to add to your October TBR for scary books, I highly recommend this book, Patience of a Dead Man by Michael Clark. As always, my Patreon and Discord information will be in the description below. Come chat with me about it if you've read it. Um, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell, keep reading, and I love you all to the moon and back. Bye.